ladies and gentlemen, my name is Elson Cruz, and I'd like to welcome you back for some more Yoshi's New Island Forever. Here we are in the mid-castle point of World 6, Spray Day Mayday. An unfortunate pairing of words, or I guess a trio, I guess, but still. Spray, May, and Day are all in there, so there we go. We've got more recycled scenery from other bosses, but this is actually probably one of the longest levels in this entire game, and that egg completely missed that spray man. That's not cool. So let's go up here and... Oh, I missed the coin! I missed the coin, dude! That's not very nice. So this castle, a little bit on the annoying side, not worth it for the Kamek fight at the end, which is hilariously bad for being the last one we have to fight him in. But uh, in this room, we've got ourselves a locked door with a couple of pipes. Let's go and uh, probably take this one right over here first. I usually take the bottom one first, but I figured, why not, you know, throw ourselves for a loop here and go through the sewers a little more, even because we're near a volcano, it only makes sense to have, you know, a running water system just going on through there. It's like, what, what are the makers of Yoshi's New Island trying to tell us? with this. Um, here we've got enemies that I don't think you can kill. Um, excuse me, these guys either take a lot of hits or they just don't die because uh, three hits and still nothing, so I don't even care. We can go... Is this just a ladder? Or steps, I guess. There's no ladders in this game. I don't know why I said that, but we've got ourselves submarine. Submarine. I don't want to deal with the submarine. Actually, we probably shouldn't have done the submarine because now we're going to be farther in the level and there's a bonus room underneath it. Uh, but guess what, ladies and gentlemen, we are now literally a yellow submarine. We, are, The game had the gall to put a yellow submarine in this game, and it's like, I'm not going to make the reference. I'm not, I, I just, no, there's going to be no Ringo singing here. Just, ah, uh, it's, like, like I said before, everybody, just everybody always says, say there any yellow submarine? No, we're, I don't care. Uh, let's just get out of here. We got Pufferfish, the only time we will ever see these guys, and you have to kill them in order to, sh to get uh, those coins. All right, good. Didn't think we were gonna get that, but give me, give me some, give me some coins. I'm at a very rough angle here. Uh, there we go. Okay, wow, this is very disorientating. Okay, let's go against the flow. There we go. That red coin. The red coin is it right there? Thank you. Of course, it's the last one. Yeah, fortunately, this is the last uh, vehicle transformation in the entire game, so just be... No, actually, I lied. There's one more. There's one more. Can you guess what uh, what one it is? Actually, we already collected the coin there. We don't need any others. So we're good. We're good. Yeah, there's actually one more after this, and it's the hot air balloon, which is weird. It's like the first one we started with, and the last one we'll end with. So I guess that's... That's okay, I guess. But we start off a little bit ahead, and uh, here we actually can collect ourselves a beautiful little key, which is really nice for us. So let's go over here and go the other way. I should have... I might have... Maybe backtracking would have been better instead of just starting over, because now we've collected everything we need to here, except there's one ledge we need to jump to, and uh, that will actually lead us to the bonus room, you guys. Ugh, oh, God. I'm tired. I'm ready to be done with this game. Two more episodes after this end work through, even though we still got quite a ways to go with this one. Eek. So in this room, what do we got? What do we got? Uh, memory, don't fail me now. Oh, this one's dumb. I think this is just a flower. But we can go kill this giant Kirby thing and then uh, call it. Ugh, almost good to go. All right, you're dead. And get rid of my yellow. Damn it. I got a red. I got a red instead of a... Uh, I hate how they have to randomize the eggs. It's so pointless. It's like they give you so many stars anyway that getting a red one is just like bad luck. It's just bad RNG. It's just terrible. I mean, I don't know why they decided to do that. I don't, it's just uh, it's so weird. Which Oh, this leads... Okay, I was like, there wasn't two paths when I came up here the first time. I'm going crazy, guys. Probably I'm going crazy beating Yoshi's New Island without taking a single hit. I'm telling you guys what. Was already, I've already practiced this game. Like, I think on my... Um, what is that thing called on the DS where you can see how many hours you've played a certain game? I've already got more than 40 hours on Yoshi's New Island, even though we've only uploaded, what, 16 episodes at this point? And I think the playlist says it's like less than four hours of actual video being shown. So that's kind of saying a lot. And I don't typically leave my DS on, so whoop. All right, be a little careful. This, this, the squirters are really irritating. Get your water out of my face, man. Oh, almost got shot in the face there by Bullet Bill. All right, cool. Let's get out of here, avoid the spikes of death, and collect our second... Yes, there is a second key there, by the way, just in case you didn't know if you opened the door and you were like, Oh no, where's the other key? But hey, lo and behold, you get yourself a nice little first key out of the way. 
And actually, we have 17 red coins and four uh, flowers right now. I think I'm actually gonna try something a little bit different. Now, over here, there's a bonus we can go to. It's not really a bonus. Uh, it says it's a bonus because the pink doors usually are like side rooms or like doors that don't advance you through the level typically. Um, but I would very much like green eggs for this if that is all possible. And of course, it doesn't give me the green eggs. Fine, whatever. I don't even care because we've had ourselves a very annoying room. Um, and just like, you know, as per Yoshi's new island tradition, they are going to be still recycling things well into the last world of the game. And so, hmm, this is kind of an underwhelming room. Oh, wait a minute, just kidding. We've got this asshole again. So, uh, so Mr. Slime Man, he was a boss in the first Yoshi's Island, and he was also a mini-boss. And here he serves as just a mini-boss, and it's actually probably in our best interest to share eggs. But um, he takes more than five eggs to kill, so I'm actually going to have to go back. And he, his movement is completely random. So that doesn't help matters much. I would, can you just give me greens, please, so I can bounce them off? It actually would be better just to like, hit them off the ceiling and then off him and yeah, all green, okay, I'll take that. I hate hoping for greens, but like when you do get them, it's like, oh man, victory is near. All right, so we gotta, we gotta start all over again. I could probably get rid of the key, but it's not gonna make any difference. All right, all right, man, let's, let's, let's uh, take care of this. Ooh, that did a lot. All right, here, you know what? Stop moving, please. I would just very much thank you. Okay, I guess hitting it off the ceiling is the way to go. Ugh. All right, and then probably one more shot. Is that is that what we're gonna take? This guy has absolutely no means of hurting you, by the way. Just those spikes. And look at that, look at that. Only three, no, four eggs this time to take him out. And there we go. You got many flowers and eggs. And there we go. Flowers and eggs, flowers and coins. Three red coins to be exact. Wow, I, did, I didn't think they were all there, but I guess they were. It's kind of cool how they were all rotating though. So you can't move those uh, platforms or anything, and running water apparently can't transport eggs, because you know, as you couldn't have told, the eggs are like moving, they were subconsciously moving, Sent sentiently is the word I was looking for. I don't know if sentiently is a word, but you know what it means. So we have ourselves, uh, oh wow, we didn't have 30 stars there, that was strange. Alright, I would very much like to get rid of my red egg, but that probably won't happen. Huh, so let's get rid of it, and please give me more greens, please, for the love of God. Because we were going to have to do that mechanic a lot. And, okay, there we go. Of just destroying just bricks from above. It's my favorite part of the day. So, ladies and gentlemen, our final Kamek fight. Are you guys excited for this? Because I'm right up on this shite to be finished. All right, Kamek, what do you got? Eek, I don't get it. You weren't supposed to make it this far. Eee. That's all over now. Your nonsense ends here. I'm sure it does. How underutilized are you going to be using your magic this time, good sir? Good madam. Okay, so basically you just go ahead and upshot and reflect the egg so that <laughs> Kamek falls into the sewers that lead to the bathroom of King DDD's castle, of course. So, well, uh, yeah, that's his magic. He's going to basically just be dropping the stones, or whatever, the blocks, and it's kind of just weird. So I would recommend just standing underneath the one you just got rid of to kill him. Uh, you'll have these Kirby's falling at you, and it's kind of funny because sometimes they can get crushed by these blocks. This is kind of hilarious. <laughs> it's like, oh my god, it's Casualty City! <laughs> okay, so now for our final attack, boom, there we go. Now be careful, because sometimes the enemies can still hurt you, because Kamek still takes three hits. You know, there we go. And we're done! How'd you get from down there to up there so fast? Ah, uh, you got past me again? This is getting silly, this is it. Young Master. Quit yelling for your master when you wake him up. I'm sure he's going to be really irate. Dun, 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 dun. Okay, I already forgot the happy ass Jake for that one, but... There we go. Spray Day Mayday has been completed 100%. I hope you guys don't mind that I'm not showing the bottom screen just because it's just, it's just for stats. And you guys... I'll show it at the end, but basically we're doing that. So we got ourselves Hot Foot Hurdle. Um, this is the auto-scroller I believe I was thinking of near the end of the last part, and uh, this one is kind of an irritating facet of things, to say the least. Don't give me red eggs. Okay, good. Okay, I'm glad I didn't grab what I would... Uh, give me more red eggs, please. God. And it just randomly starts. So, unlike other auto-scrollers in World 6 of past Yoshi's Island games, this one doesn't exactly go in on itself. This one goes straight from left to right in certain circumstances. It'll go to a completely different room where it goes up and down. So... It's kind of an annoying little thing, and the music, again, incredibly <laughs> is just not fitting of this world, and it's it's very strange. I can't really even hear it right now, but it's very strange. It's, it's got this very, you know, bluegrass kind of thing going on with it. 
Yeah, just like, uh, do you really expect this in World 6 of a, a volcano level, man? Ah, whatever, so apparently our ground pounds were enough, our butt stomps were enough to make the slagtites fall from the ceiling. So that's always nice. And it's just its just a variation of the theme. It's not even doing anything new. It's literally the theme song of this game that you hear in every single world. Just like... You know, I'm going to be so ready to be done with it. I, I, I don't even know what I'm going to play after this. I'm going to play like an old-ass retro game after this later on. Just like... Whoop. Even though I did just get done with Kirby's Dream Land 2. Hmm. Well, I guess 1995 for Kirby All-Stars wouldn't be too terrible. But uh, I like how we can hit the bottom of the broken stalactites and still not get hurt by them. Or stars. And so, yeah. It's just this game is just... I'm ready to be done with. After this, there's going to be one more episode and then the finale. And uh, I think that'll probably be good to go. I've been practicing up for that, so just be ready because... It's gonna be fun stuff. The bonus world for this, um, or the bonus level for this world is absolutely horrible. It's probably, it's very difficult, and, um, you guys will see what the, I mean by that later, but I've been practicing that pretty frenetically lately, so. Um, over here we've got ourselves arrows. Go ahead and hit the purple ones, or the violet ones, or the pink ones, if you think it's that color. And it's a very strange color, but just make sure you hit those and you'll get everything you need to immediately, so. Not too bad there. Cool. There we go. This music is just like, you're not gonna get enough of it. It's gonna be like, doo -doo 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 -doo. and we got ourselves stars here. I usually run out of eggs for there for some point, but even though we did get stars, we have 25 stars, we are actually gonna get ourselves a nice little midpoint here. I love getting midpoints right before stars, and oh god, everything's falling from beneath us. See, it's a suedo, you know, side scroll or auto scroll. I keep saying side scrolling. I hope you guys know I mean auto scrolling. And no, no, we have to grab that one down there. Or off to the right. Ugh, there we go. Or don't miss your jumps now, Yoshi. Alright, now this one's kind of annoying. I don't think we'll make it. I think we got a bad, a bad cycle. Alright, there you go, egg. Ugh, oh, damn it. If I didn't have a yellow egg, I would have gotten that lost one. I'm pretty sure that's not a red egg, which is weird. It seems like the last one should be. But 15 red coins and three stars. And there we go. So, oof. Okay, so now we've got strange, um, what are those things called? Those walker things? I can't think of them right now, but we've got those now in addition to stupid, uh, whatever these things. I keep forgetting. I am, like, totally out of practice for this right now. <laughs> but, you know what? That's okay, because I don't even care. Uh, they're gargantuars or whatever, blargs? I don't even care. But luckily, this is only the second level. This feels like it's the first level of this video, thank God. So we have this asshole to deal with again, and we've got a one man right there. So get back, please. I'd like to get myself some red coins, please. No red coins, except for that one. And there's actually a flower right here, but you want to be careful because those uh, flames will hurt you. Except for some reason, in this game, you can destroy them, but in other ones, you can't destroy them, like with your eggs. So it's weird that they'd make those guys invulnerable in other games, but not in this one. And then just random other things. Some more stars. Oh, hey, how's it going, buddy? <laughs> Didn't think that you were gonna be there. All right, can we get a two for nothing? Nope, 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 we got one for nothing. All right, cool, whatever. This guy, ooh, that should have really burned my foot there, but apparently it didn't, and that was, oh, that was awesome! Okay, I will take it, I will take that get out of here. That was definitely like the triple price of admission right there, man. All right, I will accept that very gladly. It looks like there's a ship right there to the left, that's weird. I don't know, the screen went really weird there. All right, please, for the love of God, can we get ourselves some gold medals, please, for the love of all that is beautiful, and yeah, okay. So that is only five out of 30 that we've gotten, and we're on the fifth level of this world. I'm definitely gonna have to do some off-screening for that, so I'll probably do that at the end of this part, um, just, you know, for obvious reasons, but. Hotfoot Hurdle has been destroyed, and Pyro Guide Peak. This level is annoying, but also probably the level you're going to want to do the most for your gold medal hurting, as I found in my practice file. So World 6-6, six, six, Pyro Guide Peak. Check it out. We got ourselves Pyro Guys, awesome music, and these guys are invincible to your tongue, more or less. Uh, you can still kill them with eggs, but in other games, when you would eat the Pyro Guys, uh, you would get Fire Breath, and this one, they don't let you do that, and I don't know why. It's like, why wouldn't you let them do that? It's such a random thing to say, hey, no, you can't, you can only kill those guys with, you know, other enemies or with eggs. But, uh, whatever. But one of the reasons why this level is so annoying is because there's actually a hidden portion that got me for the longest time, and it was really irritating, so death, thank you. All right, so you see this right over here? Remember that this is here because this just gives you coins and st stars, maybe? Oh, one up, okay. So remember that that was there. 
Um, because we're going to go underground and we're going to have to, you know, use our eggs for days and days and days. You will give me an egg. And the thing about this is that there's going to be a lot of uh, pyro guys as well as a lot of uh, bouncy bullets. And wow, I'm surprised that actually hit them. I would get less yellow eggs and stuff. That would be really great. So you have to take two hits to destroy all these things. All the bullets are going to be <laughs> bouncing off of everything. That just makes a whole ton of sense. And, um... Be a little careful because their hit detection, as you guys can see, is fairly shoddy. So, whoop! Okay, almost got that in. Let me get. Oh, damn it. Alright, well, that kind of sucks. Oh, okay, I guess they killed each other. <laughs> they died in their arms tonight. Oop, didn't want to do that. I wanted to grab some eggs, please, and go through the midpoint at the same time. But apparently, they're not going to have it today. There we go. Thank you. Alright, so let's go destroy these. I don't think there's anything... Yeah, this room, this little portion is really useless, but there's actually... There might be some over here. Is there? Yes, there's one. One red egg. So just go destroy everything. Just be a real maverick to this underground place. Destroy the foundation under which this entire volcano sits, and you should be pretty much good to go, okay? Because... Oh, more eggs. Or, I mean, more coins. Wow, they both died. I don't think that was from the egg, but... That's okay, as long as death was wrought upon them by my face, we're good. And for some reason that also, that was weird. Okay, let's just destroy this last part of the room. There should be two more red eggs and one flower we need to get. And this guy, can we get them together? There we go. <laughs> I love how it just goes stink. <laughs> oh god. Good times, you guys. Ooh, but Pyro guy, we want to be really careful for him because he is just a real maverick. There he is. He is the maverick of the bunch. He's like, if I didn't know any better, I would have thought he was a gerbil named Rick. But uh, let's go ahead and uh, grab our flower here, and thank you very much. So let's, can we destroy all of these, please? Thank you. All right, there we go. So one more should be down here, actually. Thank you. All right, ooh, okay. The bouncing bullets here, not a fan of, and I just spit all over my screen. I'm sorry, screen. Okay. Alright, 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 right. whoop, okay, quit shooting your buddy, oh, he just, I think that was his own bullet, oh god, they're just killing each other all over the place, that's fine by me. Alright, so we have now have nine red coins and three flowers, now this is that thing that hung me up the most, is this little section over here to the left, they give you no indication there's anything here except a little hole in the wall that you can't see. So, this is where you have, uh, uh, coins and stars, and now we have to hit another one, damn it. But just like, they gave you no real indication of that, and that was kind of annoying, because I thought it was, I was so hell-bent on finding like a secret area you had to walk over to make secret things appear, and I was just, ah, uh, I was like kicking myself, because it's like, well, it makes sense in hindsight, but like, if you're looking forward to it for the first time, and you see the other shit this game is pulled, it's just one of those things, but, uh, let's grab this, and we have to grab our last... Uh, stars. Gotta keep tripping over my words, man. Alright, there we go. Very nice. And they're playing the nice music, at least. At least that goes throughout the entirety of the level, as opposed to whatever the hell we were listening to in the last level. And the last part, just the weird, like, little drummer board marching beat. Um, here we got to sell a chomp puzzle, uh, chomp rock, and this is kind of weird. You have to bring it over these platforms, and sometimes it'll clip through pretty badly, but, like, other times you can get pretty lucky. And you don't actually need the chomp rock. Um, if you have a lot of eggs, like I do, I don't really have that many, but you can do it with, like, two eggs, then you don't really need the chomp rock, and I'm just gonna show it with the chomp rock because we're really cool, you guys. Alright, um, so let's grab this, and there should be two red coins in here, two more at least. So let's go, we have to push it over to the left, I said. I didn't say it, but I was thinking it, and you should have, ah, you should have known. Chomp rock, don't you dare betray me. Thank you for at least going on that side. You know what I'm saying. Alright, go, go, go. There we go. Perfect. Almost perfect. Alright, so we have to bring it across to destroy a bunch of uh, instant death spikes. And the thing about that, whoop, up, didn't be a little careful about that. Um, is you just destroy them like this, and so it's... No, I said go this way. Destroy them. Destroy them, I say. I, I'm, I'm afraid my shoe will actually touch them and I'll die. But we just pop them and grab them, and there we go. You need, like, like I said before, they're really easy to get just by shooting the eggs because they don't, like, cover the ceiling for whatever reason, so... You got that going on you. And, uh, we actually need one more red coin, and we're good, and it's actually over here, so die and die. Thank you, pyro guys. Never get enough of killing them. And with this, ladies and gentlemen, we have now defeated World 6-6, which of course is the fire level. Oh, thank god, and 337 lives! Fortunately, it's not 66-6 lives. God damn it! I, okay, this one I think we have to run at, actually. 
in order to get, uh, you know, medals. But right now we only have five medals and only one more level to get them in. Well, technically two, but why you would want to do it on the special level of this world is beyond me. Next time on late, next time on late, next time on Yoshi's New Island, we're going to deal with Crumble Rock Rumble, a very unfitting final level for this world, you know, behind the boss. Um, so hopefully I will maybe see you guys there. And just take note, we are near the top of a erupting volcano right now so just keep that in mind okay i will see you guys maybe in the next part i might have a stand in for that one yeah probably